I didn't know that the Grosbeck neighborhood was a cancer cluster site when I moved into it 16 years ago. I found out about it through a front page article in the Lansing State Journal. I've lost two of my dogs to cancer and I feel it's because they drank the water in our neighborhood. I do not drink the water in our neighborhood. Uh, these toxic coal ash sites are in our backyard and too many Michigan residents don't know about them. The real solution uh, to toxic pollution from coal ash is to transition to cleaner energy that will not only reduce harmful coal ash pollution, but also delay deadly coal pollution like soot. Coal ash is a toxic residue of burning coal. It contains contaminants like arsenic, mercury, lead, just to name a few. It's dangerous and it can leak into our water supply and it's doing that as we speak. The neighbors, especially in the adjacent neighborhood right here, are owed sort of some answers about what was in coal, what is in coal ash, what's going on during the transport of it, is there dust, I mean touching it and being just touching it is enough, but it also had leached into the river for 30 years because it's a floodplain. So what, what did it do to our river and what did it do to our fish and wildlife?